Hi, this is Mark Widower from trafficandconversion.com, and uh, a lot of people ask me how I manage to get so much done during the day, and uh, I'm going to tell you one of my secrets. Um, I work on a PC, I don't know if you can tell, and right now here I'm using um, Firefox, um, and if you're like me, you probably log into a whole lot of things every day. Now, you may not log into as many things as I do, but I probably log into different websites over a hundred times a day. That doesn't mean a hundred different websites, but you know, I might be logging into my blog several times a day or uh, um, into a control panel or Google Analytics or something like that. And um, I mean, I'm doing that kind of stuff all the time. Now, if I had to actually type everything in every time, my username and my password, and even um, you know, go to the right URL, then um, gee, I, I, I can't imagine how much extra time I'd take. It's got to be at least 30 or 60 extra minutes a day that I would be wasting if I did all that manually. So um, about four years ago, I stumbled onto this program called RoboForm, which is, uh, well, it saves me a whole lot of time. So let me kind of show you how this works. Um, you can see I have a RoboForm toolbar right here. And um, here I have a little bit of a, of a search box here. And um, I've got some uh, list of logins here. And I've got, uh, this is my identity. This is pretty cool. I mean, it, it actually um, will fill in credit cards, credit card forms and things. I'm not going to show you that right now. But suffice to say that, let's say when I'm signing up for something new, I can just click a button and my name, my address, and everything is automatically entered in. Um, just because I clicked that button. But um, the thing I use it for most often is to log into different websites. So I'm going to click this uh, where it says RoboForm here in the toolbar. And this is a list of all the different kinds of things that I log into every day. And there's more that you don't even see that are going off the screen. Um, and this is my most recently used list. And um, let me show you how easy, how easy this is. I'm just going to go ahead and let's say uh, log into a Gmail account. And all I have to do is just pick it from there. It goes to the right spot and it logs me in. Right, so here I'll sign out, and let's say I wanted to log into uh, my traffic and conversion blog, uh, right here WordPress TAC. That's the initials I use for traffic and conversion. Boom! It takes me directly there, immediately. It's really kind of cool. Um, I don't have to type in the URL, which right is if you run a blog of your own, you know it's WP Admin after the uh, domain name. But um, I mean, all I got to do is pick it from the list. So um, here I can log into uh, Google Analytics. I can log into here's one shopping cart tech support, right? Um, I can never remember where that is exactly, but I don't have to because RoboForm remembers it for me. And they also remember my username and password, which for some strange reason is different than my regular one shopping cart username and password. Of course, I can log into. Um, uh, ClickBank or my bank, my regular bank, or um, you know any website that I can think of that has a login, I can go ahead and do it. Um, you know, there's uh, if you use cPanel, um, one of the weird things about cPanel, it's a control panel for websites. I don't know if you know what that is. Here's the control panel for my traffic and conversion. Um, oh, I was already logged in. Let me go ahead and log out. Um, here we go. So um, here, check this out. If I'm at the right page for a login that I have stored in here, if I'm at the right page already, then I'm going to get um, the name of that thing, the name I've assigned, um, in bold right here on my on my toolbar. And all I have to do is click that, and it'll fill it in, and I can click login, and boom, I'm in. So um, it just helps me tremendously. I mean, I don't have to remember anything. It remembers everything for me. Um, and uh, boy, I got to tell you, it saves at least 30 to 60 minutes uh, of my time every day, given the amount of work I do and the speed that I have to do it at. Um, now, what's really cool is that you can get RoboForm for free. And if you go to RoboFormFreeTrial.com, um, and um, that's that's my affiliate link actually but uh, if you use that then you actually can get it for free and you can use it for a whole month um, with uh, for absolutely no charge it's full version and everything and um, you know if you decide not to buy it that's fine that thing's only like 30 bucks but um, and it's definitely worth it if it saves you 10 minutes a day even or two minutes a day um, it'll pay for itself in um, probably a week um, in any case um, even if you decide not to buy it then you can still use it forever and it'll remember up to 10 different websites for you uh, 10 different logins um, otherwise it, you know the regular version is unlimited so let me recommend that you go to roboformfreetrial.com and rem and use this oh let me just mention one other thing um, Firefox likes to 
uh, remember things for you. Um, and I don't know if I can make this come up right now, but um, let me see if uh, let me see if I go here to um, my uh, traffic and conversion. Sometimes what you'll see right here. Let me click login. What you'll see right here in Firefox is this offer to remember this login for you. And I want to warn you against doing that because what what Firefox will do. Um, is store that, but it doesn't always secure that information. It's not always um, uh, here. Let me try this other one here. It, it, it's not always um, uh, it's, it, it's secure. It'll it'll if somebody finds your computer, they can see the usernames and passwords in plain text. And there we go. So here's Firefox offering to remember this for me. Um, so if I click remember, it'll store it for me. Well, why don't I want to do that? Well, first, like I said, it's not entirely secure. And secondly, I mean, it can be. I think there's a setting for it, but I don't even know where that is. But secondly, um, if I decide to bring up Internet Explorer instead, then um, the, the, it's not remembered for Internet Explorer. And I use IE and Firefox all the time. I go back and forth between them all the time. And the exact same thing. Um, is uh, works with RoboForm. You know, it installs into both browsers and it works uh, perfectly well for both of them. Anyway, so I never see it says never for this site, never for this site. I never use Firefox to remember those things. So I'm going to go ahead and click log out. By the way, those little login boxes that you see pop up here with uh, this one right here, that's cPanel doing it. That's not RoboForm. Um, and uh, what I do is I just click the cancel button. I get to this screen and then, of course, I've got my login right there. In any case, go to RoboFormFreeTrial.com to test it out. It's really an amazing piece of software and it'll save you a lot of time. Um, it'll also save you a lot of anguish because if you are like me at all, you've probably forgotten a few passwords over uh, in, in your day. So um, give this a shot and uh, let me know what you think. Thanks. Hope that was helpful.